Good afternoon, everybody. Excited to bring you some good news. We are up here on Grand Mesa, near 10,000 feet, here fishing this beautiful lake. Cheyenne and I, we're gonna be doing some float tube fishing and we're really gonna be targeting brook trout today. It's just approaching kind of springtime up here. The lakes are just starting to ice off. We are actually up at 10,600 feet. Uh, before, that's what we wanted to do the video today, but they're still completely iced over lakes. So here a little bit lower and hoping to bring you some good action. So as you can see, Cheyenne's blowing up the belly boats. I'm gonna blow up mine right now and We'll see you guys out on the water. Cheyenne and I got the lake all to ourselves. Gosh, it's beautiful up here. Super calm day, everybody. Water's pretty clear. Probably got about six to eight feet of visibility at least. So just got a little tug. That's good. We've only been out here a few minutes, but I feel like we're kind of spoiled in that we typically catch at least have some some sort of bites or something by now oh good and then i caught a weed i definitely had a nip there we might just be chasing him today <laughs> we might have to chase him a little bit today pete thanks for hooking it up with a nice grab bag of micro minnows here cheyenne saying she's getting some bites so i'm gonna switch patterns this is that tadpole pattern, kind of the green pumpkin with cheese more. It's discontinued on the website, but some kind of some of the remnants of it. Let's see what we can do with this. Well, Cheyenne's been getting bites. I haven't gotten anything yet. No chases, nothing. I'm on the other end of the lake now. Cheyenne's way over there. I've never been over here before. It's beautiful though, but just want to venture over here. Just kind of do some exploring today. It's a super nice day out. I mean, I'm just in a long sleeve and feels even a little bit warm for that. It's about 58 degrees right now. Currently where I'm at, it's pretty shallow and there's just moss balls and moss pockets everywhere, floating everywhere. So kind of doing some light casting, but really more just trying to work my way to the other end of the lake. Oh my gosh, you guys, I got one. Oh yeah, nice little brookie. Yes. That's a really pretty one. It's really red. Got that on the green pumpkin with cheese. Yes. Been grinding. Got one. Really, really pretty brookie. Got the awesome top pattern. Nice, thick, strong guy. Beautiful brookie. Oh, finally got one, guys. Oh, it's a little rainbow, but it's not a skunk. <laughs> so I'm all right with that. He's a little guy, but he's pretty. Good grief, that's a pretty fish. Yeah, very nice. Thanks for playing, buddy. If you can see him there still. He's hanging out right down there. <laughs> oh, yep, he's on my flipper. Oh, there he is. <laughs> All right. Ooh, got one. Come here. Dude. Oh. <laughs> He's gonna be a slimy little booger. Very nice. Oh. Well, there he goes. There, yep, he was there. <laughs> Everybody saw it. <laughs> well, it's been grindy, but we're getting them. It's getting better now. What are, uh, what pattern are you using? Still. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go fire tiger. He's looking for fish. Got a bald eagle right above us. He's looking for fish. Oh, I just had a tug, shoot. I'm not even joking. I'm looking at the 
bald eagle. I don't know if you can see it very well. Yeah. Oh, wait. Here he goes. Oh, he missed. We no longer have the lake to ourselves as bald eagles fishing too. Oh my God. Yeah. Just so happens that I have a fire tiger on my other rod here. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and catch a fish real quick. Show you and this eagle how it's done. Oh no, I'm getting blown away. <laughs> I hate you. Oh, oh, I, oh, I got one. Oh, I didn't have it on the whole time. Oh, for crud sakes. Well, anyway, I caught one. I was talking too much crap to Tyler to remember to turn my stupid GoPro on. Are we keeping it? Okay, maybe I don't want to show you guys outside of the net too far because I'm terrible with dropping the fish, but I have my first brook trout this year, which is a big deal because I've been, we've gone through them a couple times ice fishing too, and I just couldn't catch one. They were eluding me, so... They're my favorite, they're my favorite to catch, my favorite to eat, my favorite to look at in general. All right, everybody. It's been a while since I've had a fish on, but I got one. Fire tiger swim bait. Oh, nice, nice thick rainbow. But yeah, nice thick, th oh. Nice thick fat guy. Pretty sweet. Nice colors. Oh. There's that eagle. You guys can see him. Holy moly. Still right there. Oh, he's getting ready to dive. There he goes. Oh, missed another one. Shoot. <laughs> Another little bricky. Well, shoot. <laughs> Super excited to be getting brickies again. Super excited. Super pretty. Tastes delightful. And I'm blown over again. All right, we have made it back to the original side of the lake. Oh, fish is rose right next to me. As you saw, we started here beginning of the day. Cheyenne had a few bites. I didn't get anything over here. So we're hoping that there's a little bit more activity. I mean, I didn't see a single rise over here the entire time we were over here and I just saw one. So that's at least a good sign. All right, everybody, I'm back to fly fishing. There are a good amount of rises around me. Got one. No way, Rainbow. <laughs> All right, everybody, a little fly fishing action. I'm pumped. Got the Copper John. Gotcha. Copper John, everybody. A little nose hook action. Got one. Oh, he bit off. Oh, I've got some hits. Yep. Brookie. It's an ultra tiny brookie. I'm gonna throw this one back. Really tiny brook trout.
Got another one. Uh-huh. Zone again. Another little brookie. Copper John. I'm putting in the work. Got one. Looks like I got him on the scud there. Really pretty brookie. Look at that. Love those brookies. So probably be our last keep of the day. All right, everybody. Hard to beat an afternoon of that. It was a little grindy, but it was such a relaxing time up here in this beautiful scenery. Got some fish on the fly. Got some fish on the swim base from Pete's Custom Trout Worms. And those brookies and those rainbows looked really good. We're going to be keeping them, frying them up later. We're not going to be filming that portion of things. Just going to be having some nice dinner. But hope you guys enjoyed this uh, near 10K elevation fishing. We're going to be bringing a lot more of this type of stuff to you. And here in the future, in the next few weeks, we're going to be bringing a lot more fun content as far as us branching out and hitting some new rivers, hitting some new lakes, and just doing some type of fishing we haven't done before. So hope you guys enjoyed. Hit the like button if you did. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, Team Cops signing out.